This activity will determine your target heart rate zone, which is 60 to 90 percent of your maximum heart rate. This is where you want to be exercising to get the cardiovascular benefits from the exercise. The first thing you want to do is write your name on your page. Okay. The next thing you want to do is you want to write in your resting heart rate, which you should have calculated this morning right when you got out of bed. That is the best time to get the most accurate of your resting heart rate. My resting heart rate was 50 beats per minute, so I put 50 in there. The next thing I want to do is calculate, I take, find my maximum heart rate which is the number 220 minus your age. So I take the number 220 and I'm 43, so I subtract 43. Okay, that is 177. 177 beats per minute is my maximum heart rate. So that you'd want to put down right in the box on step two where it says what is your maximum heart rate is 177 for me okay you can also do this to find your upper limit your 90 percent these numbers would be the same so again it's 220 over here minus your age it's 177 and that goes down in this box too okay from there you want to subtract your resting heart rate on step three. So I take 177 and I subtract my resting heart rate which is 50 okay and that leaves me with 127. Those calculations would also be the same on your 90 percent of the upper limit. So again I take the same numbers 177 subtract my resting heart rate and I get 1 27 from there. Now I want to take 127 and I'm going to times it by 0 0.60 which is 60 percent of my maximum heart rate. So 127 times 0 0.60 for me is 76.2 okay if I want to find my upper limit or the 90 percent of my maximum heart rate I take the number 127 for me and I'm going to times it by 90 percent which is 0 0.90 and that will leave me with 114.3 okay now in the calculations Prior to this, we subtracted our resting heart rate. Now, at this point, we have to add our resting heart rate back into the equation. So, for the lower limit, I take 76.2 and I'm going to add 50 because that was my resting heart rate. And if I do that, I get the number 126.2. For my upper limit, I take the number 114.3 and I add 50, which is my resting heart rate, and I get the number 164.3. So my 60% of my maximum heart rate is 126.2, that equals 60% of my maximum heart rate and 90% of my maximum heart rate equals 164.3 which is 90%. So my target heart rate zone is between 126.2 and 164.3. That's where I would like my heart rate to be in while exercising to get the most cardiovascular benefits possible.